welcome to the office. Hi. You want to be a YouTuber, right here? Yeah. Well, here's your first shot. Say hi, YouTubers. Hi. How's it going? Good. And your dad brought you down from uh, San Diego. Yeah. And we found a couple of things that were going on, and we're going to get you adjusted today. Does that sound good? Yes. Okay. And along the way, as I adjust you, if anything is bothering you, you want me to stop, just let me know. Okay. Pops, we good? Perfect. I got permission? Let's good do it. Go. Let's do it. So we're going to start with your sacrum adjustment. Let's go right side down. Put your head over here, please. Del lado derecho on your side. Now, he has a rotated sacrum, a PL sacrum. We have a PL sacrum with three millimeters of inferiority on that side. And what's really nice with, with him is he's eight. And you had this issue right now as a kid. And that I salute you that if not corrected right now, we will lead to a malformed sacrum, which is what I talk about on all my videos, guys. So this is another great example. You gotta give your dad props for bringing you, okay? Good, good. Good props, good love. All right, let's do this. Bend the top. I will go through everything. I will not crack or do anything until I'm ready and I can really get your permission. Bottom leg straight. Now, I'm gonna be right here, Emilio, right there. Is that okay? All right, so we're gonna do this as an S4. Sacrum, left side, and we're gonna torque up to get rid of the inferiority. Do I have your permission, Emilio? Yes. Thank you. And I want you to relax that bottom leg. Try not to bend it, okay? I promise I won't drop you. And here's my deal. If I drop you, I'll send you and your family to Hawaii. <laughs> okay? I wanted to go most to Canada. Okay, I'll send you to Canada. <laughs> <laughs> That's the first. Okay, look straight ahead. Relax the bottom leg, please. Down. Come closer. Come closer. Gotcha. That wasn't so bad. Stand up and let's walk it up. Let's go down on the great table now. You're gonna hold him kind of there. Okay. Just light, mm -hmm. just about like that. They're gonna go up. Okay. So just hook, don't force it up or down, just kind of hold it. Okay. Hands forward. Emilio, you good? Yes. S4. That's it. <clears throat> Are you kidding me? That was fun. You felt that? Mm, a little felt bit. Felt all the way. That just, just sunk right in. That's it. I'm not doing more of the same one. Let's do seven now. That was good. Nice. You ain't never seen that one before. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Now, hold on to the table. Smile. <laughs> How many teeth came out so far? Eight. Eight? Right hold my hand. Come on up. Come on down. Let's walk back and forth. Can you walk to the trash can over there? Turn around, walk back. His arches are fine, Dad. Please don't mess with them. Keep walking one more time. And may I do your neck now? Am I, do I have your permission to adjust your neck? Yes. Alrighty. Let's have a seat here. Sit up all the way. I'm going to be putting a seat belt on you, Emilio. Sit all the way back. Scoot your bum back. Scoot back. Scoot your bum back all the way. There you go. Shoulders back. C6, PLS, nice and light, nothing is hard. Left ear down, down, left ear down, 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 down. That's it. Home run. Good job. Walk it off, please. 
Walk it off two times back and forth to the trash can. Very nice. <laughs> you should have a seat over here, please. Let's recheck. Scoot your butt back. Sit up straight. Sit straight. Sit up straight. Touch your toes. All the way down, all the way down. Okay, sit up straight. Sit up straight. Scoot your bum back a little bit. So there we go. And let's run the meter and see what happens. Come back, yeah. Sit up straight. Sit up straight. Back slowly towards me. Let's palpate first. Five. S1. S2. S3. S4. Is that different? Yes. Tell dad what's different. It doesn't hurt. That's seven, that's six, that's five. It's less now, yeah? Yeah. Brett's a belly deep super tickler. That's cool. I'm a super tickler. <laughs> Mira. Cero. Yeah. But what I'm tripping on is that that sacral segment went really smooth. Walk one more time and I want to work on your ankles today. Let's take a look at his feet. All right, bring your ankles, toes back as far as you can. Bring them back as far as you can. Dad, look. Which one doesn't go back as far? Oh yeah, that's right. Relax, relax, relax the legs. Let it go. Okay. Ready? Pain? Which one hurts more? This one or this one? This one. Right. Now, let me do the work. Let me do it, please. Let me push it back. Okay, this is the outside. This is the inside. This is the talus bone. So when I move that, it definitely moves nice on the outside. It moves well on the inside. It's a little tight there, but it's not restricted. Okay. On this side, moves well on the outside. See, that's what's stuck. You can feel it right here. So what I'm feeling is oh, yeah. that versus, come here, this side. Oh, no. Different. There's a difference. You can help. Okay. Come over here. You go on that side. This. Hold his leg like this. Okay. Face me. Turn and face me this way. Um, Okay. okay, you're gonna hold close to the ankle. You're gonna, a little bit higher, there. On three, you're gonna lift up just about that much. Okay. Okay? Cool. That's dad. <laughs> One, two, three. Gotcha! Bam. Walk it off. Good stuff. <sighs> Tell dad what's different now. It doesn't hurt so much. Okay. Keep walking. Walk on your toes, please. Awesome. Come over here. Let's check your hands now. Squeeze my hand hard. Squeeze. Err, strong. Squeeze. Let go of this hand. Squeeze. Okay. I want you to do this, though. Keep your hand here and squeeze. Squeeze. OK. 
Okay, I gotta work a little bit on your wrist. Is that okay? Thank you. Cool. Oi. That's good. Oi. Five times fast. Squeeze hard. Squeeze. Arr! Squeeze. Arr! You're all set. Welcome to the Olympics. Any questions? No. Say thank you to the. Thank you to the <laughs> He's going to be famous. You're going to be famous. You see? Hi. Hi. Welcome back. How you doing? I'm good. You okay? Yes. So, Dad, I'd like you want to share a little bit today, right? Sure. Come on over here, please, if you don't mind. And uh, I'd like you to share, if you don't mind, kind of what's happened. We've seen your son Emilio a few a few visits. Yes. And what did he come for? Well, he was diagnosed with what is supposed to be scoliosis. Okay. And uh, after the first visit, the first visit, we noticed what you shared with us that it wasn't the case. He had other issues with him. And um, so what definitely uh, caught my eye was after the first visit, and this was the first time we've seen a chiropractor. You've and never been to a chiro this whole time? No, no. How old is your son? He's eight years old. Eight years old. Yes. Okay. And um, so- Why was he diagnosed with this though? It was two, three months ago. Okay. And um, was there a complaint of pain or anything? No, it was ever since he started walking, we've noticed that he wasn't walking as normal. Okay. And as he kept improving or kept walking more, we've seen that his walk was deteriorating. Okay. And so we've, we visited this doctor Okay. And uh, he mentioned, you know what, get some x-rays. And he noticed a slight deviation on the spine. And he said, that was, that's scoliosis. So. Uh, What's the fix? Well, the solution uh, that. To make him walk better. Yeah, that and... he suggested at the time, which freaked me out, was that if we don't put some remedy on his issue, then as he progresses or time uh, pass by, he might. Uh, lose his leg. Excuse and me? Lose his leg. Lose? Yes. What do you mean lose? Lose is... Well, it maybe. gets loose? No. Basically, they have Ron to capiche, re bye -bye? replace his leg. Um, You're kidding. Yeah. So, mm -hmm. and, and, as a parent, as you may know... You uh, didn't tell me this. But yeah, I, I, I freaked out. I'm and, and after watching so many videos uh, from you especially late at night before going to sleep. <laughs> okay. So what I did was, you know what, I, uh, I spoke with my wife and I said, you know what, we need to consider our options. Okay. And that's- Well, hold on, rewind. What's the solution or before losing the leg? What are you gonna, what, what you're saying intervention, what? Well, surgery. Surgery for what? Surgery to correct, to, uh, to place some plates on his, his leg. leg. And then it, and, and if that didn't, uh, fix that issue, then he would need to go into other measures which are more invasive. And I said, you know what, this this seems to be to me uh, a, ver a little bit drastic. Right. So we need to get a second opinion. Fair enough. And that's basically what we uh, visited and, and scheduled our first appointment with and you. And then guys. we started a couple yeah, of visits. Exactly. This is his fourth visit today. Over how long? Over uh, what period of time? Well, a month. It's been a month. Right. And I will let Emilio explain to you what he told me uh, a few days ago. Okay. But he, I was amazed. <clears throat> As a parent, I, 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 I've been seeing a, a clear difference. Okay. In his improvement on his walk, on his stance, and, uh, and also on his mood. His and, mood? Yes. You happier? Yes. You're not as cranky, huh? No. Uh, you have siblings? Just one. Brother or sister? Sister. Are you nicer to her now? Or you're always nice? Mm, I don't know. <laughs> Sometimes I try to trick her. That's okay. That's what we do to our brothers and sisters. Yeah, yeah especially more uh, towards outdoor activities. 
he's he's more uh i guess he he he, he feels uh more confident in exercising and performing outdoor activity that's the level of improvement we've seen us aside to his walk but okay. Emilio told me uh, a few you days ago, you want to share I or? asked him, so what has been the experience, good or bad, and, and exactly how how do you measure or how do you feel before coming in to see you and after the last visit? What you think, Emilio? Um, one day I said, like, that I... I, I my dad asked me if how do you feel right now and then I told him that I feel I feel that I can balance more even better than than before very nice you can balance better on your feet yes okay anything else and in tennis that I I, I play better this time usually because before I missed I missed even more. Now I don't miss too much. So you hit the ball better now, or you hit the ball more now. And, and without pain because before I only hit it to the right. Okay. Instead to the left. You got a backhand now. Yeah. Yeah. Right on. He does. Right on. And also, you mentioned about something about the percentages. Remember the first time, and on this on the on the second appointment, and then on the last appointment. How you've seen the improvement since day one, remember? Yeah. Share would, that, please. Would you like to share? Mm -hmm. What was the percentage you, you felt better since day one, since the first visit? In the first visit, I felt like 50%. Uh -huh. And the second visit, 70%. And in, in the last visit, like 99%. What? So what are you doing back then? 99% is pretty good. You're still missing 1%. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So the thing I'd like to share here is the thing I'd like to share here is this. Um, Emilio, you're eight. Okay. Dad brought you in after seeing some videos. Yes. And um, it's a big deal to, to come, okay? I mean, you guys have to drive a couple hours to get here. Uh, you have to take kind of a leap of faith yeah. and say, hey, let's see. Do you, did you, I have to get ask a couple of serious questions if mm -hmm. you don't mind. Sure. Did you at any point or Emilio or dad feel unsafe here of what I was doing with your child? No, uh, it, it was exactly the opposite. Uh, one of the things that uh, my wife and I discussed since day one was before performing anything on Emilio, you explained the whole process and you also mentioned, so this is a game plan for the next few weeks. We're gonna see how Emilio is responding to the treatment. Okay. And also you're, uh, before uh, implementing the treatment, you always ask him before doing anything and I need permission. Exactly, and Emilio mm -hmm. has been uh, reacting very positively, positively in that respect, especially yeah. because he's been involved in, in, and he's part of the process on his treatment. Well, he, you guys are here because of him. Exactly, right? Yeah. Cool, well, I appreciate you sharing. Um, there's only three visits. And with a, with a kid like Emilio, this isn't where, hey, I'm going to see you three, four times a week for the next four weeks. Mm -hmm. They're growing. They're active. We know there was a slope or fall. They respond so quickly. Mm -hmm. We just got to find which one was out, sure. right? Where's the pressure? Get the pressure off the nerve and let them live. Mm -hmm. Let them just enjoy themselves. Exactly. Uh, there was no rehab here, right? Yeah. We're just walking to be. Mm -hmm. And whenever I'm dealing with a patient like Emilio, that's kind of how we work. Like, let's figure out the first visit, what's going on, what do we have to do, and give maybe one or two adjustments, and then let them be for a little bit. Exactly. Okay. And uh, we're on visit number four now. Yes. That's pretty cool. So you're saying you're 99% improved? Yes. Okay. Well, 
That's awesome. Now I got to see what the meter tells us. <laughs> Is that okay? Yes. I have your permission? Yes. You get ready to get started? Yes. You want to tell those guys over there? Yes. Tell those guys over there. I I'm ready. He's ready. Dad? Ready to go. Let's do this. Sit up straight, please. All right. Bend forward. Touch your toes. All the way down. All the way down. All the way down. All the way down, sir. As we said, sure, we've got a couple of side deviations going on there. I don't look like scoliosis to me. Look like scoliosis to you? Yeah. yeah. Okay, sit up straight, please. Good. Let's run the meter on the back and let's see what we find today. So I'm bringing the probes slightly closer together, slightly, because the pediatric spine is slightly smaller, right? Mm -hmm. I got a little three-pointer. Here's what's interesting. It goes to the left, three, four points, comes to the right, two points. Hold on. Still on the right. You freaking me out, Dad. What is it, one? Yeah. So Dad was sharing with me just before we started that he had, are you kidding me? It's one point, two points. One point, one point down low. I thought I had some there, and this is what it did. It looked like it was going there. It didn't stop. It, mm -hmm. went, it yeah. went down, 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 and then we got the little one pointer. So I'm just sharing something a little interesting. Dad came in and said, "He, Dad, what happened?" Yeah. So uh, on our last visit, we the what is it called? The meter. The meter fluctuated up to five points yeah. and I was uh, telling Dr. Rahim that last night I had a dream that while he was uh, inspecting on his back the meter only showed one point that's crazy <laughs> and it's one point and now it shows one you point. feel that you know that? Yeah. that one right there s1 now down here anything not too much okay. a little bit right there s1 right there yeah Let's set your S1 and let's see what happens. Let's go left side down over here, please. So, before anyone makes a comment on my eye, you can see it's pretty red. Rumi and I were just having some fun and accidentally poked me in the eye. And it's all good. She's a kid. It hurt pretty bad. Couldn't see very good, but. And let's go ahead and do this safely. You ready, Lola? Okay. There we go. So we're doing S1. I'm right there. I'm going to have a pisiform contact right there. And nice and easy there. I'm going to roll you just a bit, not a lot. And we're just pushing. Don't bend the bottom leg, please. Let it go forward. I got you. I won't drop you. And we just want to push forward. Hold on. Bam. Walk it out. <laughs> so I got his walk. Now we have something to compare to day one. Here it is. Alright. Cool? Yes. Have a seat. That's right. <laughs> Gotta love kids. And yes, we do. The beauty with children is they respond so fast. Yeah. You just got to get the right pressure, figure out the pressure, and get that adjusted and get that pressure up like Mary. And guess what? Miracles happen. Good stuff happens. Sit up straight, sir. Now, what I want to see is that. Yeah. 
little flutters. <gasps> Guess what? Guess what? Yeah, Sit that. up straight, please. Sit up straight. Thank you. What were you asking just now, Emilio? Yeah, Burnett. Yeah, baby. That's sick, Burnett. I need something else to crack, though. You're what am I going to crack? I need more stuff to crack. You can't drive two hours just for one sacrum adjustment. I was being funny, guys. No nada. No nada. Go on your back here, please. And cha cha. Hi. Ankle <laughs> hey. as. One more. That was a tiny bit. You okay? Sure? Yeah. Okay. Okay. I need you to lift up on three. One, two, three. That's it. Other side. One, two. That's it. You okay, sir? Yeah. Okay. Bring your toes back towards you. Bring your toes back this way. Give me your feet. Bring them all the way back. All the way back. Bueno. All the way down. Point your toes. Point. I need to do the arch. Turn to your side. Face my x-rays over there. Very good. Well, guess what? He gets a month off. Really? Yeah. We're going to re... This what right now? September. We're going to regroup uh, mid-October. Perfect. Unless anything happens along the way, then you don't have any restrictions with me, okay? You just gotta ice every day. There you go, sir. Walk it off one more time. Bueno, bueno? Good? Okay, walk one more time, please, sir. All right. Questions, Dad or Emilio? Mm. Well, I think a little bit time ago, when I was taking a bath, like my, I think my neck hurt, was hurt when I when I did this. Okay. But then, what like two hour later, I think after the bath, it it didn't hurt anymore. Awesome. Anything else? No, that's oh, it. Awesome. Okay. So you got some. You got some homework. Your homework is to just be a kid and ice your low back. Okay. Okay. So even if you don't have pain in your low back in your sacrum, I still want you icing ten minutes a day down here. Lay down on your back. Do you watch TV every day for a little bit? Do you get TV time? Yeah. Yes. Okay. So during your TV time, you can lay on the floor, bend your knees, and just put a little ice on your back. Okay. Fair enough. And we're going to see you in about a month now. That's pretty cool. So this is visit four. We saw four visits over one month. Now you're going to get a one month gap. We're going to regroup with you in about a month. Okay? Okay. Anything else you want to share with them? No. You got it. Pleasure, Emilio. I'll see you in a month. Okay. Dad? Perfect, Dr.